years before the Norfolk Southern unveiled its 20 heritage diesels to the world in 2012 and before the Union Pacific had its six heritage locomotives before that, the Canadian Pacific had its own heritage fleet in northeastern Pennsylvania. Fitting since the Delaware and Hudson was the product of the very first rail ventures in America. Its original Penn Division main line, which ran through Carbondale, Pennsylvania, to Nineveh, New York, and east to Albany, was abandoned in favor of the ex Lackawanna line, which runs from Taylor Yard north to Binghamton and east to Oneonta and Albany and north to Montreal, Quebec, in Canada. At least two EMD Jeeps were repainted in the DNH's famous blue and gray lightning stripe livery that was not only one of the sharpest paint schemes in the region, but was also a favorite among many rail fans. Units number 7303, which had gold lettering, and number 7312, which had blue lettering, like the DNH itself, operated in relative obscurity when compared to the waves made by the announcement of UP's and NS's heritage fleets. And now, as CP has long since departed northeastern Pennsylvania for good and took what was left of the original DNH with it, we get a glimpse of a railroad that not only survived in an era when most of its neighbors were collapsing into Conrail, but also a legacy of a bridge line that now serves two masters. For Trains 21, call me, A.C.